That's been a, a huge impact. The first month after they launched it, I went up 400%. And ever since, it's just it's been going up, and it, it keeps going up. So it's, it's, for me, it's perfect. And I've, I've heard from a lot of other people that are doing more creative work that normally their works would, yeah, would just disappear in the, in the masses. And now there's a place for those images which I think is a good thing. Oh yeah, uh, one year ago in iStock introduced Veta and yeah, it's been a huge impact in my portfolio. It changed my life in a better way because I had a lot of files in the collection. Um, it works very fine. And yes, I had a, a good impact. Fantastic. Better sales results. Right. Better sales results. Few sales, but more money. Fantastic. It works. Excellent. All right, thanks. The Veda collection has had uh, a huge impact on my earnings. It's difficult to, you know, isolate it because at the same time as the Veda collection came along, I was also pushing up a bunch of new content. And part of the reason I was pushing up new content is because um, the Veda collection uh, was a place where I could start putting more creative stuff. Um, it gave me an outlet to it, uh, whereas before I was pushing that stuff onto Getty. So um, as I pushed that content up and Veda launched, uh, my sales have, uh, or my royalties have just increased dramatically um, to double what I was pre uh, expecting for this year so far. So it's also, aside from um, the direct benefit of the royalties, it's also had a positive impact on uh, the way that I'm shooting and feeling that there's a, a market and a specialized collection where I can shoot stuff that's more conceptual, more creative, and uh, it'll get more attention. Um, and, and buyers seem to be responding positively. One of the main, one of the primary motivations for us when we were uh, uh, building the VETA collection and the concept behind it was we want to give the the contributors at iStock a uh, an outlet for for more uh, intensive uh, more intensive kind of shoots things that take more time to develop things that have more uh, risky kind of concepts um, and kind of do two things uh, first of all give people an outlet for the stuff that are they're doing but second of all uh, hopefully. We want to give people the incentive to take kind of broader risks with the things they do by giving them a giving them a, a higher you know you getting the higher commission getting the higher reward at that that larger price points lets you take some risks lets you do some things that you might not have done in the past because you thought uh, that's that's a little too much uh, time and effort for 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 uh, stock shot now we've we've given people uh, hopefully inspired them to try things that they wouldn't have in the past and take some risks and kind of go further out of their comfort zone because they know that that uh, kind of uh, riskier stuff will have an audience and it'll have a, a place to be seen and people are going to be looking at it specifically because they're trying to find uh, more detailed, more creative, more uh, out there, uh, kind of out of the pocket kind of shots. And, and bring the people, there's, there's people out there who, who are looking for that kind of imagery and they're willing to pay for it. And there's definitely people at iStock who, are, who have the knowledge to create it and, and we can bring them together now. And hopefully inspire people to try their hand at things that they wouldn't have had in the past. Cool. And from your perspective, how is it going so far? I, I, I think it's been going great. Uh, we've, we've really seen uh, uh, a lot of the shots that went into the collection sell like they hadn't before, and we've been seeing people up just now that they've got the venue for it and the outlet for it, we've been seeing people upload things that they might have held back in the past, and the stuff that's coming into the queue and going into it has just been really eye-popping. And So from that perspective, we're, we couldn't be happier with what we've been getting. Perfect, thank you. Um, VETA kind of blew us away how well it sold. Um, you know, we went to our customers and said, um, you know, we think, we think it's time 
the you know the collection's getting better. We have images that are obviously spectacularly good, and we want to charge more for them. And customers were okay with that. Um, you know, they just told us, "Don't take away our our dollar images." Um, but there's lots of projects where they're they're willing to spend that extra money, and I think that's that's why um, it's sold so well. Um, you know, there's it's still not generally that expensive. You know, compared to standard stock. Um, and yeah, we've we were pleasantly surprised by by how well um, how well it sold. And I think a lot of people in the industry, we had a lot of people approach us um, who were really impressed by the quality of the images in that collection. So I think both those things have, have helped make it a success.